Hey, big night. First reason game, guys. All out. High character, but all out. Every single play. Can y'all feel me? Yes, sir. Can y'all feel me? Yes, sir. Let's get it then. Let's go. Break it down. We gotta get top speed, son. Gotta get top speed right now. We need everybody right now wide open. Let's go top speed. Go back, go back. Let's go. Boom. Catch it. Hey, go again, driver. Well, I've been here since 2005. Um, I've been coaching here 12 years, going on 13. Uh, proud to say that out of the 12 years I've been here, we've won at least nine games or, or more in um, 11 of the 12 years. Um, um, the key that I say at Griffin High School is hard work. Uh, we work extremely hard. Uh, we, we have an extremely good weight program. Uh, we, we push discipline, and we, and we build character. Now we're going to put a man in motion left to right. Snap. Nelson going to keep zone read, going to the near side, makes the cut. He's at the 15. Still on his feet to the 10. And it's going to take a host of Whitewater Wildcats to bring him to the turf and do so with a 9-yard line. That's going to bring up third down for I think the I'm extremely proud of our offense. Um, after losing um, eight or nine um, big-time players last year on the record-setting offense, uh, we're stepping up really big. Our quarterback, Avis Nelson, uh, filling the shoes of uh, quarterback Tyler Morton. Uh, he's, he's had – Eight touchdown passes right now. Uh, he's running the ball well. He's leading the offense, and we're doing a really, really good job. Uh, uh, on the defense side of the ball is where our strength is. Of course, we returned seven starters from a year, year, uh, year ago, and uh, we're playing good ball. As a matter of fact, uh, the first game against Spalding, we, uh, we had Spalding had negative uh, 48 rushing yards. LaGrange had negative 20 rushing yards, and Austin Lee had uh, – uh, 40 rushing yards on 45 carries. Nelson, long cadence, snap, drops back the pass, looks left, going to keep. He's got to dance his way to the far side of the field and does so. He's coming to the far side, makes the cut, he's at the five. Four, three, two, 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 six. Touchdown. Mm -hmm. Say family on three. One, two, three. Hey. Let's go, baby. That's what it's all about. That's what it's all about right here. Them goosebumps inside of me right now. That internal energy. Internal energy, baby. Let it build up. He, he want to he wanna go. Boom. There you go. My, my number one goal is to help our kids become the best that they can be in every way. As football players, as people, students, you know, all that. You know, understand that, that it's, it's a game, you know, and we use this game to, to, to build young men, you know. Um, Teach them how to show up to work on time, um, how to show up to work every day, not missing the days. Teach them how to push through things when it get tough, you know. So, so like I said, my goal as a coach and our staff is to teach our kids to be the best they can be in every single way. You know, um, our young kids, we have a good uh, bunch of freshmen and sophomores, um, and they're starting to experience w what hard work is like. You know, some take it different than others, but um, once again, we're going to keep pushing them and helping them be the best they can be.